Hey guys and welcome. Well, I'm back today and I had a video request saying um, how to put videos on your PSP. Now, it's no hacking matter. You don't. It doesn't matter what version of firmware you have, so most of you are in, the, in luck, the ones who don't have custom firmware as well. Alright, well, I'm going to be showing you how to put videos on because most do not work because they're not MP4 format. I'm going to show you a converter which will convert it to MP4 format for free. It won't pay, it won't cost anything, everything's free of charge, and it's a very trustworthy program, so I guess I'll start. What you want to do, you want to go to this site right here, uh, www.pspvideo9.com slash download slash. Alright, it'll be on the right description of the YouTube video this time, so it'll be a lot easier. Alright, so now that you're here, um, click on the download now button below or this link to begin downloading PSP Video 9. Go ahead and click this link, this little link right here. Go ahead and click it. And now what you want to do is press download now. It's 8.443 megabytes, so it's not big and it should take about 10 20 seconds depending on your speed of your computer. Go ahead and press save. I save it to my desktop. Alright, you can do whatever you want. I save it to my desktop to easier to access. Alright, it should be done. Mine's, I have a fast computer, so it's done instantly, pretty much. Yours will probably take about 10, 20 seconds, depending. Alright, now we're here. It should be on your desktop, wherever you save to go to it. It'll be called video, v PSP Video 9 and a bunch of other crap. Go ahead and click it. Go ahead and press Run. Now it's going to come to all the security update for me, because I have Vista and it does all this stuff. It's annoying sometimes, but it helps. Alright, please select the language. Go ahead and click any language you want. It doesn't matter. It can affect it. Alright, now what you want to do, you want to press Next. I agree. You can read all that stuff later if you want. Go ahead and press Next. Next. That's all I mean. <laughs> and Finish. Alright, now PSP Video 9 is on your desktop. You see it? It's right there. PSP Video 9. Right, what you want to do, you want to go ahead and press it. Don't be scared. <laughs> Alright, now you're here. Here it is. It's not a complicated program, so don't be stressing over it. Don't be, you know, it's not as hard as it looks. Don't make it harder than it is. Alright, what you want to do, you want to go to Convert. It'll come to a video wizard. It explains all the steps, so I'm just going to help you in a faster version. <laughs> Alright, what you want to do, you want to go down here to File Name. You want to go to select file. Alright, what you want to do, um, go to uh, where you, what video you want to convert, alright? And um, just find it. Here's my little folder of videos. But let's see, what do I want? Um, I don't know, Pain 3 Days Grace. It's a video I made a couple days ago of me playing Pain on the bass guitar. Alright, video format, go ahead and press new so it's it it'll seem good quality video size I like to make it widescreen you can change it square doesn't matter I like widescreen because it fits the whole PSP screen video quality just leave it on medium because up here it it just really overdoes it and it's not gonna make it too much better and it takes longer to convert enhance quality go ahead and press on it'll seem a lot better no no I forget that it, it, it slows it down a lot and audio quality, just leave it high. That's really good. Really good. Go ahead and press next. Alright. Now here it'll say start converting, stuff like that. What you want to do, you want to go down here. Here's the title. And you want to go to start converting. Go ahead and click it. And it'll start converting up here. It shouldn't take long depending on your settings you put. Like enhanced quality and stuff. If we would put that, it would take a long time, trust me. It would take about, I'm guessing about seven minutes. That's pretty big. This is about, I don't know, 20 seconds. And it's done. Alright, now that it's done, don't be Xing out yet. What you want to do, you want to go to Library. That's where it's installed. Alright, ig ignore the second, these two. Just this one right here, the one you converted. Alright, now it's right there, right? What you want to do, you want to go to up here pretty sure you want to go to device files I mean local files sorry about that alright go ahead and press it and you want to go to open folder alright alright and here's everything that's converted now do not drag all of this stuff what you want to do you want to look at the bigger size see what's the biggest one 4,711 4, um, kilobytes right here 
what you want to do, you want to copy that one. It says N4V2 20,000 name. What you want to do, you want to copy it, all right? And go ahead and minimize that and minimize this too. What you want to do, you want to turn on your PSP, all right? Make sure your memory card's in. Sorry, folks, forgot about that. I've been cleaning out my memory card for, I bought a 4 gig a couple days ago. Sorry about that. Buy it for hacking reasons so I can store more ISOs and homebrews and stuff, you know. It's so, it's so much handier. Right, go ahead and turn it on. No need for recovery mode or anything. This is, this is, doesn't matter what firmware you have. Yep, PSP theme changed again. Changes every month. It's pretty cool with the background. I like it. Right, what you want to do, you want to go up to USB connection. Go ahead and press X. Alright, and you'll be hooked up. Now what you want to do, you want to go to, of course, computer, removable disk, whatever yours is. Mine's F. Alright. Ignore this. Mine always does is I hate it. Come on. Move. Alright. Cool. Oh, I'll see what is this. Alright. Alright, now that we're here, what you want to do, you want to go to video at the top. If you don't have it, make one and capitalize all letters to video in the rear of your memory stick. Go ahead and click it. Alright. Ignore this. These are all, this is my stuff right here. You can ignore all that. Alright, what you want to do, remember that file you copied? Go ahead and paste it. It's already converted to MP4 format, so it will work. Alright, I'll start copying. It shouldn't take long, depending on your computer speed. It says M4B2008. Sorry about that. Go ahead and rename it, whatever you want. I'm going to rename it Pain Three Days Grace. Alright. Now you can exit out of that. Exit out of USB mode. Alright, now what you want to do, you want to go to video. Press X. Scroll down to your video. Here it is. Pain, three days grace. Let's go ahead and play it. Oh, sorry, wrong one. Okay, rename the wrong one. Oh, I'm sorry, folks. I got the wrong video. Oh well, it's still the right video. As you can see, this video is converted. I just chose the wrong video and renamed it wrong. So I hope you enjoyed this, and um, I hope you, if you have any questions or comments, just um, call me up on my YouTube or MySpace account, right? You can look me up, and I hope you enjoyed this, and um, hope you have fun. See ya.